Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For this week's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to tie the three most used and most important macrame knots. So your first and most basic knot for macrame is called a square knot. You grab both of the end pieces and hold them to middle tight and you just wrap it around and pull it through and then you tighten it. And then you're gonna do the opposite side. You grab the opposite string and pull this rope through. So I'm gonna do that again for you. Slowly, this piece goes underneath and pull it through. Tighten it. And then this rope goes through there. And you just keep doing the same knot to get this cool macrame look. That's the square knot. Another knot that's super important and really good to know with macrame is called a spiral knot. So you can just grab whatever rope you want and just keep pulling through the exact same rope and then tightening it. Pull it through. See how it's starting to turn? And you just keep pulling it through and it makes this cool spiral. Okay, this next knot I'm gonna teach you is called a diagonal clove hitch knot. And you're gonna get one um, piece of rope. You could add another rope to it if this isn't long enough. I could show you that in another one of my videos. But I'm just gonna do it this way in this one. So you grab this rope, and wherever you angle it is actually where your knots are gonna start lining up and going. So I'm just gonna do it in like a perfect diagonal. And then you get this rope, and you pull it through. Tighten it up. Pull it through again and tighten it up. So that's one knot done. You're just gonna do that twice with one string and then you grab the next string. I keep calling this string. I'm gonna call it a rope. You grab the next rope and you pull it through. Just like that twice. So see how it's starting to make your line. And you grab the next rope. Make sure your tension is the same. If you're pulling it super tight, make sure you pull all of them super tight. If it's gonna look as nice. And just keep grabbing the next rope after you've done two of them. And if you want to go the other way, you just turn the rope this way and pull the rope through that side to turn it. And you always do it twice. And then wherever you're angling it, that's where it's going to go. So I'm just going to hold it like right there. Like when you tighten the knots. And then if you want to keep going, you can just turn the rope this way and keep doing the same knot and you'll get that cool like zigzag look. But these are the three like most used knots that I use with my macrame, the square knot, the spiral, and the clove hitch. Thanks so much for watching. I hope that this tutorial video was helpful and easy for you to follow along. Once you master these three knots, you'll be able to make your own unique macrame wall hangings for your home. But if you're not that creative, then subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll be teaching you how to make macrame wall hangings and plant hangers of all different sizes.